Master the art of phrasal verbs, your key to fluent English. Hello, English language learners. Welcome to another episode of our Grammar Fundamentals series. Today, we're taking a deep dive into phrasal verbs, and not just any phrasal verbs, we're focusing on the most commonly used ones. You'll also be given some handy exercises to practice and apply what you've learned. Phrasal verbs are a combination of words that act as a verb. They are typically made up of a verb and a preposition or a verb and an adverb. For example, look up, run out, or turn off. Understanding these is crucial because they can drastically change the meaning of a sentence depending on their usage. Let's go over some of the most common phrasal verbs. 1. Turn on, turn off. These can refer to starting or stopping a machine or light. For instance, can you turn on the light? Or, please turn off the television. 2. Look up. This often means to search for information, as in, I will look up the recipe online. 3. Run out. This is used when something is depleted or finished. For example, we've run out of milk. Remember, context is key in understanding the correct meaning of a phrasal verb. Now, let's get some practice with these phrasal verbs. Exercise 1. Fill in the blanks using the correct phrasal verb. 1. I need to blank the address on my phone. 2. We have blank of coffee. Could you pick up some more? 3. Can you please blank the radio? It's too loud. Exercise 2. Create your own sentences using the phrasal verbs we learned today. Remember, practice is key when learning new grammar. The more you use these phrasal verbs, the more natural they will feel. And that wraps up our lesson on common phrasal verbs. We hope that this has been a helpful guide and that you now feel more comfortable using these in your everyday English. Keep practicing and remember to not be afraid of making mistakes. They're part of the learning process. See you in our next episode. Happy learning!